This is a WD portable hard drive. It uses external power and a USB mini B type connector. When you plug this hard drive in, the LED is blinking, but it just makes a clicking or clunking sound. I'll show you how to open one of these hard drives. The best way is to get to the front where the connectors are, get a pry tool about halfway along, and lift up. You'll see that there's a connection joint here. And it's this little connection tab in here that you're trying to separate to lift up. Once inside, use a screwdriver and you can lift the hard drive up. I like to lift away from the USB connector, which is down at the bottom. This drive has a USB adapter that converts the SATA to USB. You can simply unscrew the screws and pop it off. Inside, we can see a 2 terabyte Western Digital hard drive, model number WD20EARX. And it was manufactured in August 2012, so it's almost 13 years old. We have our donor hard drive ready for spare parts in the clean room. Now we've got the new master head assembly to fit in the faulty clicking hard drive. Now this hard drive is working again and we have access to recover all the customer's data. If you need data recovery from a faulty Western Digital external hard drive, you can mail in from any location, visit zeroalpha.com.au and we will get your data back at the lowest price.